So in 2019, LG released the LG G8, a great phone coming from the LG G7 for the great design and great cameras. But how has it aged in 2021? Let's find out. What's up everybody, this is Eric the Tech Preacher. So here is another episode of Throwback Thursday. And here's my thoughts about the LG G8 after about two years. So sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys, this is Eric back with another video. So the LG G8 was one of my favorite phones. Still to this day, this device is one of my favorite phones. So let's go on and talk about the specs. The LG G8 has a nice size, 6.1 inch, 1440p, uh, POLED display. It got the Snapdragon 855 processor. We got six gigs of RAM in this one. Uh, we got 128 gigs of internal storage. We got SD call support and all the bells and whistles here. Now I have the United States version of the LG G8, which has a dual camera setup, which consists of 12 megapixel standard and a 16 megapixel ultra wide angle lens. And then in the front, uh, we have a eight megapixel a pixel camera and in video the LG G8 can shoot up to 4k 60 frames per second and powering this device we got a 3500 milliamp battery now as far as the software this device is one in Android 10 with February 2021 security patch and lastly this device here has a headphone jack and I found this phone on Amazon for about 229 bucks. I will leave the links down in the description below. But overall, in 2019, this was flagship specs. One of the LG G8 standout features that nobody give a lot of credit to is the display. Look, the 6.1 inch POLED display on here is nice. You got very good deep blacks and good vivid colors. Watching movies and reading text is a joy on this device. The only thing that I don't like about this device, and this was a trend back in 2019, was these huge notches, right? You know, even to this day, I cannot get over the notch. Uh, even so, I'm glad in 2021, the notches are going away, but back in 2019, that was the new hype, that was a new trend, the notch was introduced. So let's talk about performance. The LG G8 has a Snapdragon 855 processor with six gigs of RAM, and I have no performance issues with this device. Even in 2021, all the games and tasks that I throw at this device, it does it very well with no hiccups and no stuttering. Now, even in 2021, this device is a powerhouse. I really do like the performance of this device. Okay, so let's talk about these cameras. LG is known to have the best in class cameras with great pro mode and a headphone jack to match with great audio if you want to connect, you know, external mics and stuff like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you some footage here uh, with this with the LG G8 and I'm also going to uh, let y'all guys see in my studio me connecting a professional microphone with a preamp use a pro mode with the LG G8. So check this out. So what you're looking at right now is the LG G8 uh, with a professional mic connected to it. Uh, this is very neat. So if you want to run like your YouTube channel off the LG G8, you could connect a professional preamp uh, also with a professional microphone to the device in pro mode and you can make all your adjustments accordingly. So right now, 
if I want to, you know, shoot all my videos and stuff like that using professional gear, the LG G8 is a device that's really capable of doing that. So what you're looking at right now, me and my studio, I have a professional microphone. I got the LG G8 connected to my preamp. I have it in manual mode right now. I got all my settings, it's locked, except focusing. I got focusing on autofocus, so it can focus on me. But I want y'all guys to hear the audio and see the video of the LG G8. So the LG G8 came out with a gimmicky feature, right? And it didn't work that well. It was unlocking the device using your hand and I really couldn't get it to work. I got it maybe 10% of the time for it to work. I just gave up on it uh, altogether. But it was a feature that you put your hand above the device when it was off and it would unlock. Also, if you watch a YouTube video, you can swipe your hand left or right uh, and it will go to the next song. Look, I never used that feature. It was something that LG threw to the wall and it they tried to make it stick, but it didn't stick. Also, they did have some nice features like desktop mode. Uh, it worked really good, not like Samsung Dex, but it did have some type of desktop mode. Uh, and the fingerprint scan on here was really fast. I really did like the fingerprint scan on this device. Overall, the features that you know and love with the LG devices are always about the cameras, always about the headphone jacks, but you know, forget about that gimmicky hand feature that unlocked the device because it didn't work. So here's my conclusion. And here's the reality in 2021. LG Mobile is no more, and the LG G8 has not seen any signs of getting Android 11 or Android 12. I'm glad that this device does have February 2021 security patch, but as, the, as we get into the second half of 2021 and Android 12 is coming out soon, I don't see no more support for this device. This phone is really was really good when it came out. It had best-in-class cameras, great performance, great display, having a headphone jack, and everything else in between. The battery life on this device was okay. Not as better suit, but it was okay. If you know that you're buying this device for the present, not for the future, the LG G8 is a fantastic device. Look, if you want to utilize this device to run a whole YouTube channel, you could connect wireless mics, laugh mics, you could connect preamps, professional high-end mics and everything else in between. And the footage in Pro Mode that's coming out of this device is great, right? This is like one of the best cameras that I've had in my arsenal, right? Uh, look, I enjoy doing these Throwback Thursday videos. Uh, I'm gonna continue to you know, pick up some old devices, uh, pull out some of my older devices and uh, do these throwback videos for you guys every Thursday. This is Eric the Tech Preacher from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about the LG G8 in all its glory. Man, beautiful, sleek device. This is Eric. See you guys on the next video. Peace.